Sweet, not bad. It's actually a decent. Ooh, ooh. I mean, you go Chow instead. Favorite deck to play in Wild. Um, it depends, really. Um, pair expansion. It used to be Control Warrior and Control Priest. At the minute, it's it's uh, uh, probably Death Rattle Hunter. I've been enjoying that one quite a bit. Um, let's not injure our Chow. Oh, I can say free parter. I'll have a little look at that in a bit. Screw <laughs> flood. So if he, uh, I don't think paladins run pirates. I can always eat my own pirate. You know, it's not wouldn't be a bad a bad call. I don't think stats are good. What do you reckon? Eat, eat my pirate. Typically not, right? Typically they're all focused on their uh, the hero power, so I think that's fine. Yeah, the cube looks like it's gonna be a good one of in that deck. Okay, peacekeeper. Oh, if he runs peacekeeper, I doubt he plays cube. Oh, um, cube. <laughs> I got cube on the brain. I doubt he plays pirates. It could be uh, a peacekeeper. I mean, some mid range run them to deal with like other aggressive decks. This guy could be playing Exodia or something like that, which could be quite interesting. I'm just gonna play Cobalt Guardian here. Oh no, he's not. That's a good fan. Attack fan. Okay. Oh, the title of the uh, the video just just uploaded. No, I. I didn't. I'm, I'm trying to think of a good title. <laughs> That's pretty interesting that he would play a wild pyromancer out into his board like that. Oh, I completely forgot. I run beneath the grounds. Genius. Now, when he plays uh, divine favor, <laughs> I'll have a, a beautiful board. I'll still kill that, even though he might cast a spell and kill it himself, but okay. I completely forgot about it beneath the ground in the deck. It's it's brilliant. Not on my Reporting for duty. I don't think this will go off. I think he will buff probably the uh, Divine Spirit one. Uh, the, the Divine Shield one. Alright, come on. You want to draw? Where's my ambush? No ambush. Oh, he's giving her up. Give it up. Yeah. I think I'm better off this and this. And then play Valera. I need a board. If I'm gonna play Valera, I'd rather have uh, you know, a bit of a bit of board presence. And I have double sap, so. Oh, he was a ha okay. He was a buff pollen. Didn't realise. This is really good. I still got a board after the uh, after playing Valera. So now I'm, the tempo I get now of double sap, it's really really hard for him to uh, come back. I guess, especially because the sap's gonna take out a buff card. <laughs> okay. 
Okay. Just get a shadow strike, shadow strike too. So he took a big, a big spell. Just get down. Get down! Uh. All right, cool. Uh, fine. Much? Could have shadow strike this actually. I thought I'd top deck a playable card though. Uh, it's all yeah, I guess. Could have shadow strike that. Oh well. I was hoping to draw, um, that, wait, yeah, I've already played Backstab, right? I was hoping to draw, like, a, I'd actually know Backstab would have been bad anyway. Yeah, she was a Shadow Strike, that bad boy. Oh, well. Uh, let's take a copy of, uh, Reno, and, uh, then Shadow Caster. That's it. Oh, an ambush. There we go. We're looking pretty solid there now. Not a bad board state. We got a bunch of uh, four attack minions, and I still still hold like double sap and a double eviscerate if I need to. And a Reno. It's useless for him to push damage, and he can't control the board. Because he knows I've got, yeah, he should, he, he can't, he has to kind of control the board off me. I want my board to be a little bit clear. Sweet ambush. You might concede now, unfortunately. But just before we, we get to play the uh, Phil's board with, with treasure. Who doesn't like treasure? You know? Who doesn't like treasure? Maybe this guy. Let's let's hope he's got like a quality consecrate or something here. He's got consecrate. Come on, everyone likes a bit of treasure. Stick around. You'll you'll enjoy yourself. You'll enjoy yourself. My hand is too full. One for all and all for the One for all and all for Not gonna attack with Bran. I'm just gonna enjoy this. Oh no, the ambush! Go away, ambush! <laughs> Everyone loves treasure, don't they? So, a lot, a lot of people ask me to do this. Enter the Colosseum, baby. That's where he took the floor. Goblet, cobalt. None may steal our He's ruining, he's ruining my phone. He is ruining my phone. Uh, 
Uh, I can't do any of the uh, the combo until I'll play this out. I can't make him get any more treasures until uh, I can get my hero power back. Divine favor. Yeah, I'm gonna try fill his board up so he can't do anything. It's the uh, the plan for it. As long as the potentially if the brand stays alive, it's a lot easier to do. Oh, oh Rick! God, Rick, thanks for the uh, the sub, man. Welcome to the oh, it's dead. Welcome to the stream. And a secret as well. So you have to shadow cast Bran, then you have to cast on the caster. It's a lot of mana to do do all this shenanigans. Let's kill this off. What was it? Oh, Avenge is fine. Whoa, it's a one angry, one angry bit of treasure. Um, yeah, then you play this, yeah, and then you just cast it again. Yes, you just want to replay it and get all the treasure out there. There you go. Okay. <laughs> so I have to clear, clear those off. Thing is, he can't play any more minions out because you can't sacrifice them. Equality. You can sacrifice them now, consecrate. Look at all those, look at all that secret, secret stuff. Let's play another one of these out. Probably not happy. <laughs> you can't. <laughs> you can't play anything else. <laughs> I will play the uh, call ball in a bit. Uh, once, once is uh, <laughs> once we've traded into him, and then he, he can't play anything. Then we'll uh, play call balls. Call ball. MC Tech, be gone. And there it is. There it is. The finale. The finale. And we are now rich. With a. Oh, <laughs> uh, there you go. Can't play anything out, and uh, yeah. <laughs> All right, I don't have to do that again. That one, that one's ticked. That that box is ticked off. Mm -hmm.